Yes, it does. Severe weather targeting southwestern Pennsylvania. Trees toppled over, power lines down, roads flooded. We've been tracking the system and covering it, its impact since it moved in, bringing you live updates on air and on our Severe Weather Team 11 app. And right now, we have Team 11 coverage tracking the damage and what's to come. We start with our reporter, Serafina James, live in Ross Township, where a tree fell on a woman's home. Serafina. Well, David and Lisa, we all know that severe weather can mean extreme damage, like at this town, this home in Ross Township. I want you to take a look at this. This is a tree that came down in their backyard, and some of it hit the roof and took out a part of their porch. As the rain came down Thursday evening, so did several trees. The first I encountered was on Nelson Run Road in Ross Township, but I wasn't able to see the damage firsthand. But we didn't even get close to seeing the tree because Duquesne Light Crew stopped us and told us there's a live wire on the ground. And in Munhall and in Wilkinsburg, high winds damaged power lines. But the worst damage of all had to be at this home, also in Ross Township. Half the trees around here were like bending over because the wind was so hard. And then I heard, Phew, and that was it. Paul Forshe and his wife have lived in their Clarewin Avenue home for at least 15 years. They believe the tree that came toppling over, taking out part of their roof, gutter, porch, and a portion of their neighbor's fence was nearly 100 years old. And it came down and hit this top of my uh, back porch. And then a few minutes later, I heard a little bit of like rumbling and it rolled off the top of my roof. And to add insult to injury, Forshee tells me he just replaced his roof this year. He estimates the cost of the damage from the downed tree to be in the thousands. It could have been a lot worse. As big as that is. Scary. Yep. In Pittsburgh, Serafina James, Channel 11 News. Right.